Uh, hi friends, how are you? Um, today we're going to be talking about uh, um, how we can delete uh, unnecessary files from the from the hard disk or from the computer. These are the files that that we actually um, not going to be using or we are not using anyways, and we just want to get rid of these files to have some more space on the computer. So for this one, I'm just going to use uh, a built-in program in Windows, um, which works really, really well. Uh, it's called Disk Cleaner. So if you're in Windows 10, uh, to get to Disk Cleaner, all you have to do is go to your search Windows option and then type Disk Cleaner. Uh, it should appear there. Sorry, it's not Cleaner, it's Clean Up. It's called Disk Clean Up. So that's the one over there. And I just um, right click on it, um, run it as administrator. You can actually just click left click as well, but I just, um, uh, I like to always go with run as administrator. So once disk cleanup starts, it's gonna calculate, um, look for the files that are not required by the system anymore, which are, which uh, the system can delete and save some more space for you. And these are basically, you know, the, these files can be the files in recycle bin, which you are normally aware of. And apart from that, this might include files from the Windows update, you know, whenever Windows are updated and it, it downloads a few files. And then once the update is installed, those files still stay on your computer, basically. And they are of no use and you know basically we, we can get rid of these so at the moment this cleanup is looking for those files as you can see it's it's currently scanning windows update so there we are um once this is uh, this cleanup is, has done its scanning it's gonna load up everything um all the files in there that are not required these are defender files, you know, some other downloaded files and recycle bin is included into this and then the temporary files. These are the files, you know, if you want to read it here, these are the files basically which were downloaded when uh, windows were updated or, or uh, you know, some other windows process has happened. So basically we don't need this and all we need to do is check all of them. In my case, all of these are checked. You can check these as well. Um, so just do OK and delete files and it should start deleting those files for you. Um, depending on um, when you upgrade it to Windows 10 and it's, it's depending on your system, it might take anywhere between one minute to about 10 minutes to delete all those files. Um, once it's done, it's just you, you basically your computer is clean. So if you go into my PC, you'll see we got a bit of more space here. Um, another one, if, if some people don't have Windows 10 to start up disk cleanup, um, there's another way to do it. You just open up your Explorer. Um, you basically go to this PC, you go to your, this PC and you click on the drive you wanna clean up, right click onto that and go to properties and you will see this option of disk cleanup here and when you click on it, it's gonna open up the same, um, the same program that we opened up the other way. Um, this is for Windows 7, um, it's more convenient to do this way, I always like to do it this way. So that's it guys, so this is how we do a general cleanup of the computer and you will actually see if you have upgraded your system to Windows 10 from Windows 8.1 or Windows 7 or in some cases if you have done a custom install of um, of your operating system you might have you know lots and lots of files which you don't even know are not being used by the computer so with this utility this software you can actually get rid of all of those so thanks guys, thanks for watching this video. Um, please, please, please subscribe to, to this channel. Um, I'll be coming up with some more tips and tricks on Windows. Uh, thank you very much guys. Thank